The Me Too movement is empowering victims of sexual assault to speak up and tell their stories. And in Montana, a group called Jane Doe No More continues to do that too, giving a voice to survivors with the help and guidance from those who've been there already. We learned more about the organization and the woman who brought it to Montana. It's just such an uncomfortable subject. Nobody really wants to talk about it and it needs to be talked about. Barb Jenkins is talking about rape. And as the woman who organized the Montana chapter of Jane Doe No More, she's helping to empower victims of sexual assault. We have a voice and it needs to be heard. We need more people like us that are willing to step out and tell their stories, but really tackle that subject. You know, there's lots of organizations out there, but this one is completely 100% survivor ran. There is an epidemic in our nation. It thrives in darkness and is fed by a culture of secrecy and deceit. Jane Doe No More is a group that began in Connecticut. Its mission is to empower survivors of sexual crimes to find their voice, advance their healing, and educate others. Barb found it while struggling with the after effects of her own rape by a homeless man in Missoula. I actually was really suicidal and I was looking for something that could be um, supportive to me without um, making me feel like I had to stay in a victim mentality because they didn't want to stay there. So it's a very positive um, survivor-led organization focuses on the after the rape, the positive things that we can do to um, make a change in our society because it's such a huge problem. The organization goes into schools with a program called the Safe Student Initiative. They've already had presentations at Missoula Sentinel and Big Sky High Schools. Jane Doe No More also produced a video called Duty Trumps Doubt to enhance training for first responders. The program includes a self-defense class called Escape Alive, and there's a private Facebook page for victims to share their stories and find support. This is the first chapter in Montana, the first actually outside Connecticut. In its two-year existence, it's trained sexual assault survivors to be on the Survivor Speak team. It's about stopping the rape culture. And Barb says this is just the beginning. I would love to be able to get into more schools. I want to go to other cities, Great Falls, Kalispell. Every time that I've given this presentation, somebody has come to me and said, thank you, I needed that you know, and, and they've disclosed their abuse to me every time. Barb wrote a book about her experience with her sexual assault. It's called Burying Jane Doe. Now, members of this team will be running in this weekend's Missoula Marathon, so watch for them, and you can learn more at janedoenomore.org. You can also find them on Facebook.